Hello and welcome to the Cheadle Academy. It's really sad that you guys are not able to come in to see us in action today, but hopefully by watching this video you'll get a little bit of an insight into who we are here at the Cheadle Academy. We see ourselves as a creative, caring community, and I think using that word community especially is something which embodies everything which is about the Academy itself. I've been here at the Cheadle Academy now for about seven years as its principal and over that time we've seen a lot of changes and I was so proud that last year when Ofsted came to visit us in May that they saw what great progress the school has made and they gave us good in every single category and were impressed and the thing which they were most impressed with and if you read our Ofsted report was our students. I was proud of them that day, I'm proud of them every day, I'm proud of everything which they've achieved. Now we as a school, you know, we get the results, we have the academia, we go up the league tables that's proof and pudding you can see that for yourselves however for us now it's about you know supporting the whole child obviously at these unsafe, these difficult times should I say it's about promoting and keeping people safe secure and obviously in that caring community that we look out for one another that we support each other so it's not just about the results but it's also about supporting children's mental health safeguarding our students and making sure that they find school a happy place for them to be at this point come on in let's have a look around Obviously it's really difficult for me to take you around to show you every department in the school but the one thing which I do really really admire what happens here at the Cheadle Academy is how we foster independent learning and creative thought. You know I'm here in one of our art rooms and we find that subjects like art, photography, music, all of these really sort of bring out the independence of our students. Also they get some of the best results in the county. You know, so really from the individual expression through to the end goal of getting those qualifications, going on to our colleges, going on to universities, it's something which, you know, we're really proud of and we're really proud of the work which our students create. Something else which I'm really proud of, proud of about the Academy is obviously our fantastic team of staff who are here to obviously help support students, nurture them and obviously to get them past the finishing post. We're here in maths. Now we're in a really good position that we do have specialist teachers in every one of our subject areas. Obviously maths being one of them even though there is a national shortage across the country in many schools. In maths we obviously try to promote challenge but adding that creative element to hopefully help our students to engage and some of our students do so well in maths that they go on to study it at A level and then also go on to study it at some of the top universities around the country. So hopefully by seeing this type of work which we do you get that insight into that academia which we've progressed with. Here at the Academy I'm also really proud of our sporting achievements. Obviously we play many range of sports against local teams and within the school but what does really please me is the amount of extracurricular sporting clubs which we put on to support our students at lunch times and after school. We're really pleased with our great sporting facilities. We are currently getting our gym refitted out and obviously we've got a great sports hall on our site as well. As you can see, science, one of those subjects which are really popular with our students. Obviously, we've got many students who go on to A-level and on to degree level to study this. Again, fortunate that we've got a number of physicists, a chemist, biologist who teach across the board. And it is one of those subjects which I think students really get a lot from. At the Academy, we realise for a child to be successful that we need to develop the whole child, that whole wraparound ethos. Um, our pastoral care is second to none. Read our Ofsted report, Ofsted came in to see us last year and they were particularly complimentary about what we do to support our students. By working together, collaboratively with parents, with students, with staff, we will always get children to be the best that they can be. Obviously, one of the important aspects of the Academy, like I said before, is our community. It's about a year ago when I was stood here with our whole sixth form choir with um, the Associate Dean from Staff University where we were putting together um, a charity single for the Douglas Macmillan Hospice. This came out of when we sadly lost our deputy head a few years ago and our sixth form then at the time wanted to raise some money to support the Dougie Mac. They started just by carol singing with the Tesco's in Morrison's in Asda and then this grew. Staffordshire University got involved, they decided to record a charity single, they appeared on Midlands today. How about this for Pupil Power? Students from the Cheadle Academy in the Staffordshire Moorlands have released a charity single which is already making its mark in one of the download charts. And raised £20,000 towards the Dougie Mac. And this obviously meant that they were also one of the top downloads in the Amazon charts. That came from our students. It was driven, from the, driven by those students and it was their idea. 
For me, nothing makes me prouder of what our community can do when those things happen. At the academy we've got lots of students who come from lots of different primary schools and no sooner they arrive here that they start to make those new friendships and uh, new relationships. Obviously there's lots of opportunities for students to make extra friends and those are things like when there's battlefields trips to the um, EAP, to New York, to Berlin. All of those things you know, can give those little bit of extras but obviously ultimately it's about our community and what takes part day to day in our school. Okay, we're here in one of our many ICT suites within the academy which obviously supports the digital learning of many of our students. Um, but whilst in here I wanted to mention just about our parents. We have at the Academy such a fantastic group of parents who do support all the work which the Academy does in trying to promote and support the students to pr make excellent progress throughout their time at Cheadle. It's been very clear every time I've visited the Cheadle Academy that both staff and pupils have a very um, positive relationship and the pupils are very respectful of the staff. I am also extremely impressed by um, the relationship that the Cheadle Academy strives to have with local schools and the involvement that they have. Okay folks, hopefully this video has gave you a little bit of insight about what we're about at TCA. Um, obviously these times have meant that you haven't had a chance to come around to see us in action and that's where we know that our Academy shines. But seriously, all I can say is that you have my word that when your child joins us in September that they will be joining a creative, caring community. And I look forward to seeing you then.